Hey Johnny, I just read that one of the prisoners of the KZ Neuengamme was a famous boxer in Berlin. Can you tell me more about him? Yes, I can. His name was Johann Wilhelm Trollmann. He was known as Rukeli to his friends or Troll to his fans. He was born to Sinti parents in central Germany near Hanover in 1907. He could have gone on to be one of Germany's most successful boxers, but his career and indeed life were cut short by Hitler's dictatorship. Trollmann suffered racism though even before the Nazis came to power. He was already dubbed the dancing gypsy by the press and racist caricatures of him had been printed. However, things would get much worse with the onset of the dictatorship in 1933. It was in the summer of that same year that Trollmann fought an Aryan boxer by the name of Adolf Witt here in Kreuzberg. When it became clear during the fight that Trollmann was going to win, the organizers stopped the fight and declared it undecided. Well, fans reacted very angrily and eventually forced the organizers to declare that Trollmann was indeed the winner. In another fight later on in the year, organizers would pull the same stunt and this time they would be successful. It was this loss that was the first in a string of similar so-called losses that when coupled with the Aryanization of professional boxing in Germany meant that Trollmann couldn't fight. And if he couldn't fight, then he couldn't earn money. And so to earn money, he started to take part in unofficial fights and this resulted in him losing his boxing license. Shortly after this, in 1935, he was then arrested and taken to a prison in the Berlin district of Lichtenberg. It was here that a doctor deemed him mentally incapable and said that this coupled with his history of crime meant that he was to be sterilized. Trollmann's forced sterilization took place in December of 1935. A few years later, in 1939, at the onset of World War II, Trollmann was drafted into the Wehrmacht. He would then fight all across Europe for the country that had sterilized him a few years before. That is until February of 1941, when the Nazis declared that all gypsies and gypsies of mixed blood must be cast out of the army. And so that's what happened to Trollmann. In fact, he was sent to the Neuengamme concentration camp. He then died in unknown circumstances in 1943. In 2003, the German Professional Boxing Association finally finally recognized Trollmann's victory over Adolf Witt back in 1933. A memorial for him now stands in the Berlin district of Kreuzberg, where that fight took place, and his family was presented with his belt, naming him light heavyweight champion. Thank you, Johnny, for your answer. If you want to see more of him, follow him on Instagram and TikTok.